This is a fake iPhone 14, and we are here outside of a pawn shop where we're going to try and pawn this fake iPhone 14. Hello. Hi, yeah, I wanted to sell this. Yes, uh, receipt. I have it like online. I don't have to have a physical receipt. Which model is this? The 13? That's the new one that came out, the 14. Not like an email receipt or anything. Can I get like an estimate at least? I'll just get an estimate. Okay. I'm trying to get the A number. The Apple A little 212.5. Oh. Here. I don't know that. Yeah, it doesn't work. You the model number? It's or? a new one, so it's a little more confusing. Well, it's not. It's usually you click on it and it gives it to you. Okay, you trying to get the model number? Look, all you gotta do is do the. I did do that, and it's going oh, to. Oh, wow. It's not do working. Oh, yeah, you're right. Usually. I know, that's all I usually it, do. Usually, do, you know how you do this? So that's a model number on it. So usually when you press it, it gives like you it gives number, you the, like the other online. number. Oh, really? Yeah, this new one is really weird. I don't know. Really? Yeah. You don't like it? No, yeah, I ordered it online and it's just been acting weird, so I don't know. Really? I just wanted to sell it. So I could just buy my mom birthday present because her birthday's coming up next week. So I was hoping I could sell it. And then I bought it online. So you know how the receipts are like online. They're not physical. You almost don't have the Apple symbol in the back anymore? Or? I didn't even notice that. Probably be in the like 250 range. 250 yeah. for a new iPhone? Yeah, they're $8.99 at Apple. So. Wow. Mm. Yeah, I put in the price at Apple. Because so. uh, I bought this one for like $1,000 because it's the pro. That is crap because I paid a thousand. Okay, I paid $100 for this. So $250 for it? That's not bad actually. <laughs> but she was getting it all wrong. She thought it was the, the plus, it was the pro. She didn't even know what she was talking about. She looked at the, the 14, not the pro. I'm like, ma'am, do you know how much this phone is? This is $1,000. No, it's not. It's $100. What's so crazy about this phone is that it's so realistic that when they went in the settings, there's actually like like a model number and it looks like an Apple like, setting page like it doesn't even look fake you know what I mean but when they were trying to click it like it wasn't working <laughs> it's just i14 pro max and then the guy's like oh there's no Apple logo on the new phones that's weird I'm like <laughs> it's just so weird we fooled them and we'll get $250 for this even though we only paid 100 we're not gonna scam them though because that is wrong Hi, um, we're looking to sell. It's the new iPhone 14 that just came out, so. Do you have the receipt by chance? I have it on email. Do you know how much you can give me for it? So I wanted to see how much the pawn shops will buy it for. It's the 14 Pro. Uh, well, I bought it for a thousand, so I know you guys have to make a profit here, too. I mean, would the pawn shop do like 600 for it? So the most I literally would be able to do is about 340. 340? $340. Even though it's the iPhone 14 Pro? The only reason why is, okay, so it's selling for a thousand, right? I'm not gonna be able to sell that for a thousand. I can only price it at eight hundred dollars. Okay, because you can't sell it at like the full price. Okay, so 340 not even like 500 No, but it's in like really good condition too. Know, it's like I, brand new. I understand, but it's just... Okay, well, thanks so much for your help anyways. I appreciate it. Hi. Kidding me? So these people also did not recognize it was fake at all. They were like fully convinced. I even turned it on and showed her. She's like, oh yeah, it looks really cool. And she said they would give me 340 for it, which is like nothing. Okay, technically it's a good profit because we paid 100 So since everyone is falling for it, that's a real iPhone. I'm going to turn it off so they can turn it on and see this really weird screen yeah. and they can kind of have some doubts about it and then I will try to convince them that that's how the new iPhone's supposed to look. So we'll see if they will still fall for it and if it says this. Hello. Hello. Yes. We're actually coming to see if you guys take phones. Uh, it's unlocked. Well, this phone's like normally like a thousand dollars. Everyone's been asking for the receipt and I have the receipt on here. So. It's a 14 Pro Max? Uh, yeah, that's what it's supposed to be. I bought it online, so I have the receipt from like online. No, I don't, I don't think this one's legit to be honest with you. Like not Yeah, the difference real? between this one and the Pro Max, so the key feature I'm seeing, one. No Apple Watch. I didn't even notice that. Two. Are you sure it's not real? Because like it looks super real. Like no, it's not. It just feels off too. The response on it too. No, you're lying. And then the, even then the model number is a little I literally too. bought it on OfferUp and I like... Okay, how much did you spend on that? Oh, it's definitely Thanks. not real. Key feature right there. It's not yeah, together. Guys, you got burned. Bad. No way. Yeah, Dude, I bought it on OfferUp for like $800. Yeah, I've seen those phones before. You can actually... A lot of people get burned on them on eBay and stuff. Are you it's sure? Because it's the new iPhone, so it's like different. So like... Mine's a 13, right? Yeah. You see the key feature on the lenses? Are you sure it's not just because it's like the new phone? Yeah, look here. It's the same same thing. So that phone is a whole lot lighter. It's not because it was like the new one. Like, look, like this, the page is normal. And then like, if you have like the apps and stuff. If it works, like, it works. The apps are like the same and everything. Yeah, it just looks, it just feels off. I just wouldn't be able to take it either. So y'all wouldn't take it? I'm sorry about that. I haven't had any other iPhone 14s come in? We've had them come in. We're only taking at and I've mm -hmm. seen them already and they, that just looks really off. It looks really off. Just a camera alone. So the, what should I do? Cause like, I mean, I bought it online and they gave me a receipt and everything and then. Maybe try to get a refund on it. Yeah. 
Phones are just a hard market for us right now. Even alone, uh, like a, a fake iPhone would be a harder to sell too. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what to do. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. You had this happen before, or? No, I haven't had that happen to me. But or any other customer so far, but I've seen it in the past where other shops told me I have friends yeah. working in other shops too. Dang. Yeah, sorry about that. It's all right. Dude, Thanks. Offer, Offer up. Uh, I was going to say, if you bought it through like a, like a retailer, you can file for, what is it called? Uh, like fraud? Yeah, technically. But if it's on Offer up and you met them in person and gave them the cash. Yeah, I thought it was real when I looked at it. So. Sorry about Dang that. it. Okay. All right, thank you. I'm so bad. I'm so bad. I feel so bad because they're so nice. I feel so bad because they were so nice. They're like, oh, y'all filming another video. They didn't tell us anything. And then like, I'm, oh, it's a fake. Blah, blah, blah. And they're like, oh, sorry about that. And I'm like, I wanted to start crying, but then I was going to start laughing. <laughs> Looking, hoping to sell. And how much are you looking to sell it for? Uh, well, I bought it for like a thousand dollars because it's the newest one. So we do like twenty-five to thirty percent of retail. Twenty-five to thirty percent, so like six hundred. Twenty-five percent of a thousand is two hundred and fifty dollars. Two hundred and fifty. Three hundred dollars, maybe. Is an iPhone eleven? It's the fourteen. It's the new one that came out. Yeah. So you put it through and see what it says. Can't you tap on this and get it to? Do the uh, A number A twelve sixty or um isn't that the number right there? No, it's just the new one, so it's like a little bit different. Usually, yeah. when you tap on that, it will tell you. Yeah, I've been having trouble working with it too because it's new, so it's different. Finally, <laughs> my phones are pretty expensive, so they're always like a thousand dollars or something. So one of the things it's telling me right off the bat is that uh, you can find them for right around seven hundred dollars. Yeah, so what it was to give you is, is about $230. $230? Are you sure you can't give me more? It actually, it actually wants me to give you $166. $166? Even though I paid 1000 for it? Sure there's not more you can give me? Step around here real quick. 143 That's what it's telling me it would like for me to give you. Max that it would like for me to give you is 166 I'm pushing you to 233 But like I'll do anything. Like if you could just maybe give me like 400 Like I, it's my mom's birthday coming up and I don't have enough to buy her a gift. And I like I bought this online and then I didn't, I spent too much money on it. So I needed to return it. And so I was hoping that someone would give me more money because I spent $1,000 on it. All pawn shops work on a 25 to 30%. 25, 30%. Would you buy it for me? No. No? I don't, I don't do iPhones. Sorry, hold on. I just spent a lot of money on it. I understand. <laughs> like 250? Two thirds where I'm at, and I, and I need to. <laughs> and it's not running your IME, so. I would say check around. Check around? Let me uh, check real quick, okay? Okay, thank you. I'm such a bad person. Such a bad person. You better tell him. No, I can't tell you better him. Tell He's him. not gonna understand what's going on. Back in character. God dang, I'm so, I'm so bad. That is the best that I can do is for 230. 230? So I tell you what, shop it around. If you can't get better than that, I'll be glad to give you the 230. Thank you. So 230 is your final offer? All right. Well, thank you so much. Anyways, have, have a care. Day. Oh my God. All the theatrics, bro. I feel so bad. I'm like, I had to turn away. I, I was like, like oh, oh my God. That was really bad. But they were going to give us $230 here, which is not the most. But again, I paid 100 So that would have been a seal and deal. So with your little sob story. Me with my sob story. I'm like, it's my mom's birthday. <laughs> and I will not actually sell this fake phone to any of the pawn shops, just FYI, because that is illegal and messed up. Easy pawn, here we go. We're looking to sell. I want to see how much you guys could give it me for it. How much were you looking to get for it? Well, I spent like $1,000 on it, so maybe like $800. Because it's like the new iPhone 14, so it's like brand new. It literally came out like last week. Where'd you get it from? I got it from OfferUp. To be honest with you, I don't think this is a real iPhone. What do you mean? This one's the iPhone 14 Pro Max. Oh, you got the 14 Pro Max? Wait, wait. No, but it looks the same. What do you mean? Yeah, camera's going on my different. And then, I don't know if you see that little thing up there. Huh. That too, the island. The dynamic island. I thought it was supposed to look like that one, like yours looks fake. No. I got mine from uh, AT&T. Oh, you guys from AT&T? I got mine from OfferUp, so I mean. I paid like a $1,000 so for it. Like, they were like showing me and everything. Like, I don't understand. Like, look, like, if you slide up on it, it's like all the Apple apps and everything. Like, that looks just like Apple. Yeah, some of the um, fake iPhones can actually do that to where they actually wow. look somewhat similar. Another thing, the model name, an i14 Pro Max. 
That's what it is, iPhone 14 Pro Max. It's an iPhone 14, not an i14. And that's I14. Something you're supposed to be able to change. And then the name on it too, smartphone. It's a smartphone, yeah. Smartphone you can change, but they're not supposed to say stuff like that. So you're, you're saying it's fake? Um, I can almost guarantee it's fake. Are you sure? Because I literally spent like $1,000 on it. So you're saying I just like lost $1,000? <sighs> so y'all won't like give me anything for it? Like, <laughs> sorry, I'm sorry. <sighs> I bought it on offer up, so I was like, thought it was like legit and like I looked at it and everything, it like came in the box and everything. So nothing, like not even like $500 for it? My mom's gonna kill me. Can I trade you like one of the phones that are here for it? I can't, I can't take it in at all. Like it has like Apple on California. Like even the camera like looks good and everything. Like it works. So what should I do then? Uh, best bet, get in contact with OfferUp. You don't want to buy it from me or? <laughs> oh! Ah! So made. I'm so made. <laughs> You're like, ma'am, can you leave? The, can you leave the store, please? Oh, this is so horrible. But they could tell it's different. Like it obviously like looks fake. Like there's, it's not a perfect fake. Like there's some people, like the older people, that don't really notice, and then there's people like that that are young and like understand how Apple looks. And he had an iPhone 14 Pro. He had it, and I'm like, I'm like, I think yours looks fake. Right, we've been getting some pretty good offers though. Like 300 bucks, 200 bucks. Hello, I'm looking to sell. I'll take phones, right? Real busy today. A little bit. A little bit. Yeah, I just bought it online, so. It doesn't give me the model number. Oh, that's weird. I mean, it's a new phone, so it's like the newest one. So I know Apple is like weird sometimes. It's the 14 Pro, and I bought it for like a thousand dollars. So. And you bought it where? I bought it on offer. I bought it like a week ago. It just came out. So. Well, is there like something you could put in the machine or something? Because it's like the 14 Pro. That's weird. Do you think the phone? I mean, the phone like looks good though, right? It's like an iPhone. Yes, I don't know nothing about. I don't iPhone. know about anything about iPhones. Samsung. <laughs> yeah, Samsung. I mean, that's Being that it's in a different box, that's weird. It's no, that's not the box for it. If she's saying it doesn't match the model, no. Mm. That's the girl, they scammed you. Know? Yeah, they scammed? Yeah, they probably did. Uh, well, I bought it on offer up and I was like, kind of like. They make they make fake ones Hello. and they'll say it's an Apple 14. Fake? And they'll have, yeah. You might check it to like the Apple store maybe. Because I bought it for like $1,000. I didn't buy it from Apple, I bought it from somebody else, so. I don't know to Apple check. for that much. <laughs> so you Apple? Apple? Yeah, that's what they are on Apple. Apple will tell you. Because I bought it before it was released, so. Well, Thanks, yeah. If I was you, I'd try to return it back to, to offer up. Let them know that you got scammed. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hey, mom, they're telling me that the iPhone's fake. No, no, it's not fake. It's just in the wrong box. It's not fake? No, no, it's the real Apple. It's just in the wrong box. No, the, uh, it doesn't have a, a model. Okay. Oh, well, it's, yep. It's a fake Apple. Yeah. They're, well, they're telling me that they can't buy it for me because it's fake. That's and I spent like $1,000 on it. Take it to the Apple store. Yeah, they're telling me to take it to the Apple store. Tell you exactly. they have the machine. I don't know what to do, Mom. Just take it to the Apple store. Take you it to the Apple to, store? You need to report that guy, whoever's Report it? I would. Go to the Apple store first, let them tell you, and then if it's, they tell okay, you it's wrong, on. then contact offer up and then report him and get your money okay. back. Yeah. So y'all won't give me any money for it, even if it's fake? No. I guess I'll take it to the Apple store, Mom. I don't know, that's what they're telling me to do. But I'm sorry, because like I didn't know that it was fake when I bought it, Mom. That's how they get you. Well, I spent like a thousand on it, but I thought it was real. I'm sorry, mom. Well, I thought it was real. Like they told me it was real and they, I don't know, mom, I'm sorry. Okay, mom. Okay. All right. Okay, bye. <laughs> Thank y'all. <laughs> oh! Honey, and I'm like, oh. so this little button right here, they keep clicking it, and it's supposed to do something that it's not. So everyone's like, uh, no money from this one. Hi, uh, we're trying to sell today iPhone 14. It's Peyton Pro? Yes. How much are you trying to get? Um, well, I paid a thousand, so the new one that just came out, so like 800 maybe. This one, they wouldn't be able to take it just because the network and the carrier is unusable. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. yeah. I don't know. I got it online, it was super weird. Like, did you notice that it was kind of like a weird quality, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's not the original. Apple, so we wouldn't be able to take it. No, the pawn shop was super crazy. They instantly shut it down. They were like, we don't take phones because they saw the camera and I guess they kind of knew what was going on. So they were like, oh, we won't take phones that aren't real. And I'm like, 
How did you know that? I guess they just didn't want the new iPhone 14. That's their loss, you know? Later. Oh my gosh, guys. I think we're done. Word just got out from all the pawn shops that they're messaging each other, saying that I'm in there trying to film, and they're trying to ban me. So I think this is our last pawn shop video ever, and I'm officially banned. But if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!